Hello everyone and welcome to ACAD Guild. In this video, we'll see how to work with advanced filters in Excel. Okay, so advanced filters in Excel, how do we work on that? So basically we have uh, four examples in this uh, series, in this section. So let us see with the first example here. Now I have the data source, same data source which I'm using here, employee name, date of hire, employee status, position and the pay. Now what I want to do is, I want to filter out the employment status as active okay all the active employment status and I want to paste it here okay this is what I want to do it usually when we do we can do it with the help of basic filter also okay so if I take you to previous sheet that is basic filter okay how do I filter it using the shortcut key Control shift L click on the drop down deselect select all click on this active click on ok control a control c and then you right click paste it okay this is how we do the advanced filter copy paste right so if you see if I scroll down everywhere I'll be getting only active cells right but now there's a catch here when you try to you know unfilter this text okay unfilter this or you can say it's clear filter if you click on this drop down clear filter okay you see if I press escape key now these are the data which is given here so it is basically a lengthy process of filtering the active employment status okay that's a traditional method what everybody follows so what was the method was you keep your cursor apply a filter select active click OK copy and then you paste it here so so many steps are there involved but I'll show you some advanced technique of the filters that is advanced filters so I'll come to the sheet named as AF1 AF1 is advanced filter example 1 AF2 is advanced filter example 2 so let us see about this AF1 okay so the criteria is employment status should be active I want to paste the data here itself okay so what is the method so the first step is uh, you have to understand three things this is my source data this is my criteria okay right now in our case the criteria is this much but if you select this criteria that's not a problem so source data this is your criteria and this is your destination the place where you want to paste it okay so let us see these three things how it works in advanced filter so I'll keep my cursor in the data okay go to data tab and you see beside this advanced beside this filter option I have something written as advanced so here advanced it says options for filtering using complex criteria okay using complex criteria so I'll just click on this advanced button carefully observe here what has happened is I'm able to see this dancing ants you see there's a dancing ants which are automatically selected why because my cursor was inside the data so if you see the first option it says list range list range is nothing but your source data you see the source data is by default selected here now the second one is criteria range as I said earlier you can select criteria this much or I'll put a backspace or you can select the criteria like this okay one and the same because the other records are filled as empty make sure you take care you need to write the criteria outside the table you cannot use the criteria within the table okay that's a condition here and third option is copy to I want to copy to some blank space here here itself but carefully observe the copy to option is disabled it's deactivated the reason is because of this two radio buttons the first radio button says filter the list in the place and second option says copy to another location so I'll select the second option copy to another location and I'll click on this copy to cell and select any cell over here okay let's say if I select any cell here and you can click on OK button now carefully observe what has happened all the records whichever had the active status is been filtered out and only those has been pasted here okay so it is it is very easy very useful where you don't have to waste lot of time in inserting and removing the filter okay let us try it once again okay first of all I'll clear this data select this data I'll just simply clear this option here and I'll try to do it once again okay just have a look the step would be 
keep your cursor in the data go to data tab and click on this advanced button three things you have to remember the source the criteria and the destination so source is by default selected if you see the dancing ants it was selected criteria so I'll delete the criteria and I can select the criteria like this or I can select the criteria like this and the third option is copy to another location and by using this I can just remove existing one and I can select any location here the blank space now after doing this three things you simply click on OK button carefully observe all the employment status having the status as active is been pasted here so it's very 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 easy to work with right advanced filter remember this option advanced filter right this was a basic example of advanced filter I can say a simple example but in the coming videos you can see there are few complicated examples now how do we work with this complicated examples using advanced filters right but for time being I hope you have understood how to work with this advanced filter example one and that's all for this video